What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Liquid Crystal walkthrough. Okay, so in the last episode, it was a little bit of a of an experience because we got to learn about Team Saturn trying to locate some Dragon type or you know some freaking uh, what you call it, some legendary Pokemon. At the Silphsco, we got ourselves a second uh, Master Ball, and now if you talk to this guy, yeah, he will actually give you the TM29. Which can be used for... what was it? It's Psychic? Yeah, it will actually help us out right here, so that's good. That's very, very good. Anywho, um, let's see. Well, everything's gone to normal right here, uh, except for the whole thing in Lavender Town. Now, if you talk to this guy right here, there's a place called the Trainer House in Viridian where trainers gather from all over the place. That is true, and before we do anything, we gotta get some items because... Yeah. We used up a buttload of our full heal or full restore, so now, let's see, we don't have any kind of a hyper potion, so we're going to be buying a buttload of those, and actually, hold on just a sec, hold on, we gotta, we gotta get more full heals just in case, because, yeah, that, yeah, you can never be too sorry about that, so, I think the next thing that we're going to be going into is, we're going to be battling uh, Sabrina's gym, yeah, it's, Free for the taking, so Saffron City Gym, Leader Sabrina, the Master of Psychic Pokemon. Alright, so let's go right in. Let's see what this is all about. Homie here is like, yo, champ in the making. Sabrina's psychic or Pokemon site are use psychic power instead of force. Fighting Pokemon are especially weak against psychic Pokemon. They'll get destroyed before they even can even aim a punch. That is so true, so let's go right ahead and accept the challenge. Okay, so now things have gone back to normal. We can start using some other Pokemon right here to start beating people. So, speed button away. Let's go. Anywho, guys, in the last few episodes, I've been mentioning about uh, potential ideas for, ne for my next remake walkthrough. I know that I haven't even mentioned anything about uh, any, an extra... What was it called? Uh, whatchamacallit? whatchamacallit uh, an extra hack game. And I currently have Pokemon Brown on my on my computer right here, but I don't even know if I want to play it because I, I, I still have, like, I don't know anything about it yet. Now, if you guys have any kind of recommendations for any kind of hack games, then I should probably play, like, you know, Pokemon Brown. I've heard of Pokemon, uh, what was it? Light Platinum? Just comment down below. Let me know what you guys want to see onto this channel because right now we we're still currently in a uh, oh crap level 62. What the hell? Oh damn! Holy crap! Okay, yeah, we're still currently in a pandemic, and slowly but surely we are uh, we're actually getting uh, well some some places open, and hopefully I'll become essential again because you guys don't remember I am a personal trainer and. You know, like eventually we will we will go be going back to work. So I'm gonna try and stock up as many episodes as possible before we before I go back to work. And well, let's see, I'm gonna try and figure everything out right here. Let's see, talk to this guy, Karate King destroyed. Yeah, okay, so go right here. Did we already battle this lady? Yes, we haven't. Okay, so Doris, Slowpoke, Thunder Punch. And these guys are a little 62, so I'm, I should be worried a little. And here we go, Hyper Potion. Let's go. Let's go. Thunder Punch. Thunder Punch. There we go. And Shellgun Grow is a level 40, so let's go ahead and switch to our level 64 Pokemon right here and slash away. Alright, let's get this. Slash away, withdraw. God dang. Defense is like crazy. There we go. And defeated her. Okay, so. Another thing too that I was talking about in pre in another in another episode was the fact that was the fact that uh, well now that I'm not playing well now that I'm playing the Pokemon Liquid Crystal right here and then I've already done Crystal maybe it would be a better idea to play Pokemon Heart Gold instead of Pokemon uh, Soul Silver. I played Soul Silver about I've had it twice right here on this channel. I've had them deleted first one because of, of my partnership and the second one because of a uh, you know the new the new contact that, that I was gonna create right here for my channel so I was kind of thinking to myself why why play it a third time you know why have it a third time if we have games that are similar to Pokemon uh, Soul Silver and even you know even 
focused on Suicune and all that stuff. So I kind of figured that, hey, you know what? Let's go with Pokemon Heart Gold and hopefully, you know, it, it will be, become a success or anything like that. So that is another walkthrough in the works, plans and everything, guys. So I don't know when I will be coming out with that or when I'll start recording it, but it's a for sure thing that we will be doing for Pokemon Heart Gold. So now here we are in front of our girlfriend. Hmm, Sabrina, it's been a while. I missed you, baby. Let's go right ahead and earn our ninth, or our ninth badge right here. Or eighth, tenth? Yeah, tenth badge. You can't count. I knew you were coming. Three years ago, I had a vision of your arrival. You're after my badge. I don't enjoy battling, but it's my duty as a leader to confer badges on anyone who has proven him or herself worthy. Since you wish it, I will show you my psychic powers. Alrighty, let's do this. Gym battle number 10 against our girlfriend, mm, 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 Sabrina. Oh my god, she's looking lovely as always, and she has herself level 54 SP on right here. So let's go with a slash attack. Of course, you're going to try and decrease your speed or your, your accuracy and stuff. And there we go. Best way to defeat these psychic type Pokemon brute force or a dark type Pokemon, ghost type Pokemon, that kind of stuff. They have very, very weak uh, physical defense, so that's a that's one of the one of the moves that you can actually use. So here we go. She's coming out with Mr. Mime. Here we go with a uh, Bam a Slash. Yeah, buddy. And here comes that Psychic Attack. Oh crud! Here we go. Slash Attack again for the win. There we go. Alrighty. Okay. And he's, she's gonna be coming out with an Alakazam. So let's go right ahead and just base it. Straight through. Strong ass Alakazam, and I missed, god dang it! The one time I had to miss. And here's that for Psychic Attack. Nearly takes me out. Here we go again. Slash Attack. Nearly does it, and here comes another Psychic Attack. Ah, crud. Come on! God dang it! And there goes Erwin. So, how are. Okay, so how does she have two Pokemon trainers? They have Pokemon at level 62, and she has regular, you know, average Pokemon. I want to know that. Okay, so let's go with the Swift attack right here. And it does it. Say goodbye to Alakazam. Cinder wins again, and Shellgon keeps on growing and growing. There we go. Throwing out that peace sign. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. She still looks fine as always. Your power. It far exceeds what I foresaw. Maybe it is impossible to fully predict what uh, the future holds. Okay, you win. You earn yourself a Marsh Badge. Okay, alrighty. So we got ourselves the Marsh Badge. We got ourselves the 10th Badge. And I am throwing that peace sign, guys. I am throwing out that peace sign. The Marsh Badge draws out the subliminal powers. Although I fail to accurately predict your power, this much I know to be true. You will be a cel or you will become a celebrated and beloved champion. You don't say, baby. You don't say. I'll see you later. Mm -hmm. In hard gold. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, so that that's ten badges right there total, guys. And I'm trying to figure out how to get the heck out of here. And uh, well, there it is. Look at that. Okay, so psychic power, huh? If I had that, I'd make a bundle on the slots. Yes, you would, but you don't. Okay, so that is uh, that right there. Now, we do have an option of going to Cerulean City or Celadon City. Uh, since we already know what's going on around Kanto right now, we are going to we're gonna stay put and we're going to go straight to Celadon City and just take care of business over there too. So, again, guys, thank you for watching the episode. Um, hope you guys are doing well, especially during the quarantine and all that stuff. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys for another episode of Pokemon Liquid Crystal. See you guys. Thank <laughs> you.